At Greenwich House, we serve our community by supporting the individual. From health services to early childhood education and after school. From supporting older adults to providing rich encounters with arts and music. You can regard the breadth and depth of our work in a shared history of 120 years. And it all started with a building on an unpaved street. Mary Simkovich opened the doors of 26 Jones Street on Thanksgiving Day, 1902, committed to improving the living conditions of New York's most crowded neighborhood. Public housing reform, early workers' compensation law, and many of the ideas and achievements of the early 20th century progressive movement were incubated here and at other settlement houses like it. And although Greenwich Village today looks so different, the fabric of our community continues to draw strength and life from Greenwich House. We began basic medical services from the beginning because without health, an individual cannot thrive. And we have bravely responded to major health crises from the flu pandemic of 1918 to the AIDS crisis and to our recent experience with COVID. Early to recognize drug addiction as a health issue, our philosophy of harm reduction has its roots in 1963, when we established New York's first walk-in outpatient counseling center for drug treatment. And in another first for the city, the Methadone Maintenance Treatment Program, which began in 1970. It now serves hundreds of New Yorkers on a path toward more healthy lives. Through outreach efforts in Washington Square Park, Greenwich House continues to confront the opioid crisis head on by proactively offering support and services to those who need and want them. Just down the block, our Center for Resiliency and Wellness provides trauma-informed mental health and recovery services for people of all ages. What began as the Children's Safety Project and the AIDS Mental Health Project, both founded in 1987 to meet urgent needs, has developed into a vital resource for all New Yorkers. Education and childhood development programs began early. Our flagship building at 27 Barrow Street was conceived with children in mind. It includes a gym with a running track, a theater, and a rooftop playground. Child care began in 1919 as a way to help working mothers. And Barrow Street Nursery, established in 1987, continues to serve the families of Greenwich Village with an emphasis on community, diverse perspectives, and joyful children. An after-school program was established in 1942, and today we continue the rich tradition of arts, crafts, and physical play began so long ago. New Yorkers understand the importance the arts play in a thriving community, and for many, a fulfilling life. You feel it walking through the village, taking your seat at our theater with Ars Nova in residence, walking the halls of the pottery, and climbing the stairs at the music school. These places are burning with life. Music classes began in 1905 and evolved into a school through which some of the world's greatest teachers and musicians have passed. The Greenwich House founders recognized that all people should have the opportunity to experience and express themselves through music, and that spirit lives on. Today, Greenwich House Music School fosters community through programming open to all and offers students and professional artists alike the tools and space to explore, create, express, and appreciate the beauty of music, dance, and theater. Founded in 1909 as a craft school, where the largely immigrant population could learn a marketable skill. Greenwich House Pottery is a vital institution for both the village as well as the global ceramics community, providing classes, artist residencies, an exhibition program, and facilities for ceramicists of all levels. The pottery is a place that honors the creation of art as something worthwhile in its own right, bringing people together and giving lives purpose. As the village has changed dramatically, many of our residents get older. Recognizing the need, Greenwich House started an over-65 club in 1955 and its first senior center in 1966, creating a place where older adults can enjoy a hot meal and find community, physical activity, and the arts. 
Our recently opened Workforce Development Center allows older adults to learn new skills and find opportunities for meaningful work. In times of crisis and in the day-to-day -day life of New Yorkers, Greenwich House bears witness. We agitate and activate. We support each other and build a better neighborhood. You can feel it in the walls and on the streets, in a set of spaces that we've inherited that have made possible this legacy and will continue to enable our impact for another 120 years. From the most basic to the highest needs of the individual, we are caretakers of this mission, and we invite you to join us.